Welcome to my end. Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to J Games, of course my name is Jay, and right here we have another episode of Hearthstone, Heroes of Warcraft. Uh, today I will feature two of the other classes, I believe it, they are Rogue and Warlock, and um, as you see here in, the, in my quest menu, I'm sorry if I do this, but I uh, lost my original commentary, so I'm doing this uh, post game. I hope it doesn't bother you, and I'm gonna try to uh, make it work. I know my actions will, uh, can sometimes be a bit snappy, so I'll just do my best to keep following the, the, the games. So first, we play Warlock. Of course, a demon based um, hero with a lot of uh, health deduction to its own, uh, to its own, and to the enemy. And by dealing damage to itself, it gains, um, well, by dealing damage overall, it uh, gains advantages by dealing damage to the opponent. But he can heal himself and by uh, dealing damage to himself, he can draw extra cards and so on. Your soul shall be mine! Your soul shall suffer! So right here we have a mirror match. And right here, this is a pretty good uh, early game hand. So, I believe I stuck with it. Yeah. Getting not another Galarian Mage. I believe right here I start off with Elven Archer. Giving one point of damage to the enemy hero. Uh, the Voodoo Doctor here is um, good for a roll plate. Is good for a um, warlock deck because it can negate the uh, damaging effect of life tap. Right here, I drew uh, corruption, which I believe I use to kill his. Um, Dark I know that that card that he has out that uh, minion, I know it is quite good uh, because it only costs one mana and it is taunt and Three health, but I can't remember what it's called. Uh, because of corruption, that minion died, so he's out of taunt now. Yeah, I use life tap here, getting another food inductor. So I basically overpaid mana to summon a food inductor. Not only men, but two health points as well. Blood imps are bloody annoying. They are, they can just, they don't restore health to other uh, minions. No, they give health. 
So it's tax. So many possibilities. And they are in stealth. So you can't destroy them unless you or attack them. Unless you um unless he deals damage. Right here, I believe I go for the Ogre Major. Or not. To the Laren Major this. Then even And then sacrificing my Voodoo Doctor to um, damage his Blood Fan Raptor. Now I don't use the Warlock very often. So I don't have many of its cards ready, such as most of the demons. So bear with me. Here he corrupts my Dalaran Mage. And then giving his Silverback Patriarch a little health boost with his Blood Imp. There I use a uh, Life Tap to get Mortal Coil. Which I use on his platform raptor, killing it and drawing next to card, which at the moment is useless to me. And here I deal a little bit of damage to his uh, silver back patriarch. Now he brings out another big uh, taunt creature, but I quickly take care of it using Siphon Soul, not only destroying his uh, his I can't remember the name right now, but uh, his taunt and. Uh, regaining three health. Uh, get behind right me. here, I have a pretty big hand, but they cost quite a bit of mana, so here another taunt creature, which I believe I corrupt. Like, oh, using. And that was a bit of a mistake. I should have used um, the drain life instead of uh, corruption. I don't know what happened here, I just got to draw next to the guard. Shadow Bolt. Very annoying. Here I get Hellfire, which will which will play a big role later on. We'll see. Here, the Lair and Mage out. Increasing the strength of my Drain life. Taking out the Silverback Patriarch and healing myself for two points. out some taunt of my own. Now the Mogish, uh, the Mogushan um, Warden is quite annoying because it has a lot of health. 
doesn't have a lot of attack, but that health is very annoying. Here I believe I use Hellfire. Yeah. Pretty much clearing the field except for his uh, Magusian uh, Warden. Here yeah, putting out some uh, taunt of my own. With my silver back page you are being a, in a bit of an advantage because of having more health. You will definitely be winning that one on one fight. For not at all. Now my silver bag will be a bit of a disadvantage. Are you ready for this? Here he uses that succubus, which cost, uh, costed him a card from his hand. I didn't want to lose that uh, big card. That costed six mana, so I put that out first, and then went with uh, succubus, so I would lose my uh, chill wind yeti. Ready for action! Using drain life to get rid of my silverback. And then putting more. Don't out. Here, getting another chill game. It didn't really matter, but I just put it out. There's sometimes is a bit of a delay with my game, that's just because, well, partially because of my internet connection, which isn't always the best, and partially because of me using a laptop, not a good computer. But the laptop often does the trick, it's, like, it, it's not perfect, but... It does, uh, it does its job. Nothing more to ask. Yep, and here going for an overkill. Not even leveling up my uh, Warlock. Which was a bit of a shame, but... So, right now... I was saying I already used the priest in the last episode. So and um that wasn't really a perfect game to show off the warlock because of my lack of demons and a lot of the other uh cards a warlock uses. They're going for a rogue match. And I'm not sure, but I believe I went up against another warlock. Your soul shall be mine. Watch yeah. your back. And I remember some of the uh, combos I made and counters. I was able to use against him. Like this is a really good hand. I have options to start off with early game as well as options for later game with that assassin blade. This match was a little bit shorter I believe. You'll see why. First here I go out with 
to work in Infiltrator because of um, its health, so it won't be taken out easily like with an Elven Archer of his own or such. It was just a bit safer. Safer to play. Here that he had a blue chill warrior, I believe. That just attacked me directly because it has charge. I used the coin and then uh, used my dagger mastery to get the dagger. Again, some a little bit, bit of lag, I guess. And then my South Sea backhand. Because it gains charge if I have a Here weapon with we it. Dealing some damage. And going in with the dagger of my own. And then using Shadow Step to. Uh, keep my uh, South Sea deck and safe as well as um, make making sure um, uh, also making it free right here I got sap so he used succubus but he lost a card right so first I go out with my South Sea Deckhand, giving him charge, because I have a, because I have a weapon equipped. And then I use Sap on his Succubus, so he would have to um, give up another card from his hand in order to summon it. Here we go. Here dealing a bit of damage to his taunt. And then sacrificing myself to see deck end. Then dealing some direct damage. Why do you call? Breaking my deck on. I start off with Dagger Mystery, then my Bring me steel. then backstab, dealing some damage, and then Master Sport Smith. Here, I believe I Here just. Uh, go in with my hero, taking some damage. I'll give it a shot. Job's done. And then going with my elf arch dealing some direct damage. Ah! Here, my master sportsmith gave my. Often arch some extra attack power. Use demon fire to destroy my archer. Here getting a pretty good time. Uh, what was it called? Ascension Sentinel? With a pretty good taunt creature. And just some damage not much to say we're making my uh, tongue creature a bit more dangerous for him to go after
<laughs> and your deadly poison making my uh, assassin blade in, uh, in, we go. making it do more da even more damage. So now he was at eleven health. Now he just starts spamming words. Just Defender of Argus, quite annoying card. I did not count on him having that. A that is usually more of a card paladin's use. It's very uncommon for a uh, warlock to use it. And this truly was a mistake. It's time. Here we go. Your soul shall suffer. I will your be your soul death. shall suffer. Here brings out another chill wind. Then just dealing some minor damage. He already knew at this point that it was over. You wouldn't be able to do anything. Do some minor damage. Then I get a uh, backstab, just making this um, defeat a little more painful because to this blue jerk warrior. Here we go. Going in with the pirate and then dealing the fine damage myself. So here why I went level up. But I didn't get any new cards that will come next level. Which is a bit too bad. I would I would have loved to get a new uh, card for my rogue deck. So um that pretty much concludes the episode 6. I hope you all liked it. It was um Yeah, it Sorry for the recording of the commentary. I was just kind of stupid and forgot to actually save it. So uh, I will see you all next time. Uh, keep watching, drop a rating, like the video, comment down below, and 